welcome back to the channel today again i'm just showing you the some interesting town hall 15 nt1 star ring bases all bases are pretty cool and tested in the legend league also so just make sure to hit the like on that video and make sure to subscribe our channel and without wasting any time let's get started and move into the base number one guys you can see all the war bases is here and it is quite amazing guys literally i'm just telling you it's amazing and mainly the spell tower placement plus the tornado placement is pretty cool just check out the base number 1 guys you can just see it's totally a ring base okay and just check check out the spell towers uh, one is on rage one is on poison it's uh, it's quite deadly uh, combination and you can see uh, monolith in the <laughs> 12 o'clock side and also tornado at 9 uh, o'clock side it's interesting nine o'clock or maybe seven o'clock type of thing it's okay tornado placement over here it's definitely betting a lots of time with a battle blimp if a opponent is doing battle blimp from that side is definitely got betted with a tornado with a two black mines it's definitely giving a too much damage on the battle blimp and he didn't start from a 12 o'clock side because monolith is uh, quite a high hit point damage on the troops so definitely it works well and otherwise just uh, check out the tesla farming troll tesla i'm just selling uh, like uh, on 6 uh, o'clock side and you can see over here one more tesla on 3 uh, o'clock otherwise you can just see the black mine and all the trap placement is pretty cool eagle into the center of the base with uh, cc over here and just uh, check out the scout view of the base definitely it works well because opponent troop is just go circular on the base it didn't take down the town or no lots of time town all didn't take it down and it's just quite irritating type of thing and uh, for a opponent's kind of thing it's going to be a one star attack so it's okay and let me show you the walls of that base and after we are just talking about the war cc also and you can just see all the walls and one more interesting thing you can see the open wall passing it's quite confusing man uh, only a one side is open wall passing otherwise all base is just packed <laughs> okay and let's talk about the war city what type of city do we need in this base i'm just telling you just take out the three ice golem plus five archer combination is pretty well on that base and it works well and second cc otherwise uh, you just can take a uh, ice sound plus head enter plus h4 archer in this war cc it's definitely or legend cc also it works well So let's move into the base number two for today's base, and it's again a ring base, but it's a different type of ring base. You can see over here, it's a, you can just see the inferno placement is a in a line three inferno two multi one single is deadly. Also, you can just see the center of the base with the tornado batting with lots of bombs, and also giant bomb placement is pretty cool. And you can see the. Tornado ramp placement is between Town Hall and Eagle Artillery, and also you can just see a one Poison spell tower, one Rage, and you can see the Rage spell tower. He's just covering Exbo, Town Hall, Scatter Shot, Eagle, Tesla, like lots of traps, Builder Hut. It's quite deadly, and Poison spell tower is you know the power of a Poison spell tower. It works well in a legend league, and you can see a monolith placement with a king and a grand warden, and with four four hidden Tesla there because it's also a heavy damage side and upper side with three inferno. So opponent definitely got confused uh, where to attack. And on a twelve o'clock, you can see a uh, troll Tesla. It's okay. Uh, maybe sometime the last building is also alive is that Tesla. And lots of time, ninety nine percent attacks is also happen on that base. So it works well. Let me show you the scout view of the base. You can just see the clear scout view of the base. It's quite amazing. And let's go and let me show you the wall passing. You can just see the opal wands from there. Here also, here also, and uh, opal wand placement is just uh, a good thing about the bases because army just. Uh, go another another side different different sides maybe so it's definitely quite confusing for a troop and uh, uh he did enemy didn't take uh, didn't make a good funnel on that type of bases so okay it's hard to funnel on that type of bases and it's worked well in a legend league and uh, wars also and i'm just talking about the war cc now what type of cc do you need uh you can see in the center of the base and uh, just take a lava hound ice golem simple combination lava ice with five archer combination is pretty well with a one maybe kind of a 
head and tail you can use uh, no just use one lavound ice golem dress five archer is best otherwise you can use head enter combination with super minions like uh, three super minion rest head enter plus archer combination is pretty well on that base and it works well so let's move into the last base of today's video the base number three it's different it's not quite a ring type base but it's a ring type base why i'm just saying just check out the base guys and you can see the town hall compartment on a like three o'clock side it's totally betted with a giant bomb with a tornado drive and many times it's blim got bit and with a two deadly poison spell towers so loads of time it's got baited from the front town hall side guys it's quite interesting on that base and you can just see in the back side with a two scatter shot plus eagle compartment also baited with lots of giant bomb black mines bombs and lots of things you guys can see over here and it's definitely good base and i tried in a legend it works well and you can see the two sweeper placement from that side so lots of people are just thinking about that base sweeper placement is opposite side so just go just uh, deploy a 2-3 loon and just take down the town hall but it's not happening because of that compartment you can see it's heavy with a bomb with a tornado trap with the giant bomb single inferno monolith two poison spell towers so your town hall definitely get survive and that base is works well in a legend already tried you can just copy all the bases from the video description just click on that link and easily copy the bases and uh, let me show you the squad view of the base you guys can see over here clean view and lots of people are just thinking just deploy one lava hound and just deploy a blimp to take down that uh, whole thing with a blizzard with a super archer clone but it's not work definitely it's got weighted and it's uh, a good thing about that base let me show you the walls of the base it's quite irritating quite amazing type of wall placement on this base it's quite amazing and let me uh, tell you the war cc what type of cc do you need simply i'm just telling you just take out of an eye sound with head and turf with four archer combination is worked on that base very well so all the three bases is done there all the base link provided in the video's description you can just go easily copy the base and tell me in the comment uh, what base do you use in your legend league tell me in the comment and people also want and uh, just uh, tell me what is the uh, what do you think who is the number one base number two and number three who is the best tell me in the comment below and if you're new on my channel make sure to subscribe because we are very close to complete 40,000 subscriber goal make sure to hit the subscribe is just free nothing just click on that red button and just thank you in advance make sure to subscribe and hit the like on that video like him is 100 likes maybe we can achieve or maybe not but hit the like like on the video maybe meet you in the next video clash on have a nice day clash i love you all